Hey traders, for today's trade, we are looking at a bear call spread in payment stock Block Inc, formerly known as Square. So taking a look at the stock on MarketSmith, shares of the point of sale payment software provider have slipped below support at their 21 day line. The stock is possibly gathering support at the 50 day line here, but it may also be headed lower. So far, the stock has pulled back over 19% from its February 2nd highs. The payment stock has been struggling for quite a while following a sell-off from the stock's late 2021 highs. Since then, shares have been stuck below support at their 200-day line until January of this year when the new bull market rally boosted shares back above their 50-day and 200-day lines. Traders who think SQ will fail to hold above the 50-day line in the next few weeks could look at a bear call spread. A bear call spread involves selling an out-of-the-money call and buying a further out-of-the-money call. The strategy could be profitable if the stock trades lower, sideways, and even if it trades slightly higher, as long as it stays below the short call at expiration. This risk-defined strategy is one of the four basic vertical spreads you can put on using options. So let's take a look at my trading platform and set up a trade in block. So looking at SQ here on Thinkorswim, here's how we're going to set up this trade using the March 17th expiration. We are simply looking to sell 180 strike call while simultaneously buying the 85 strike call. Using the March 17th expiration, we can sell an 80 strike call and buy an 85 strike call to set up the bear call spread. Traders selling the spread would receive $110 in option premium, which is also the maximum possible gain on this trade. The maximum loss would be $390. The spread will achieve the maximum profit if SQ closes below 80 on March 17th, in which case the entire spread would expire worthless, allowing you to keep the $110 option premium. The maximum loss will occur if SQ closes above 85 on March 17th, which would see the premium seller lose $390 on the trade. As always, remember that if you're new to options, make sure you practice with a virtual account before risking any real money. And remember that options are complex and investors can lose 100% or more of their investment in some cases. Be sure to check out the new options trader app from IBD for more digestible options education and tons of great trade ideas. And be sure to join us here for our regular options content where we break down a new trade idea every day. Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching Investors Business Daily on YouTube. If you wanna watch more videos, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a thing.